Hey everyone, welcome back to my another After Effect tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to create Lond Flat Drop Shadow animation in After Effect. So, let's see the preview. Open After Effects and create a new composition. I'm calling it Shadow. I'm using 1920 by 1080 resolution. 24 frame per second and my duration is 10 seconds longer. Before we move on guys, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and click the bell icon beside it, so you will be notified when we post a new video. That being said let continue. Right click to create a solid, I'm calling it background. I'm using color green, you can use any color of your choice. Click on the text tool. You can type any title of your choice. Go to align to set your title to the middle. If you can't see the align go to window and select align. Set the title to horizontal center alignment and vertical center alignment. Click guide options and select title, action safe to set the title to the middle of the composition. Go to Effect and Presets. If you can't see Effect and Presets go to Window and select Effect and Presets. Search for CC Radial Fast Blur and move it to the text layer. Change amount to 100 and move the CC Radial Fast Blur anchor to the left top of the title. Go to Effect and Presets and search for Matter Choker and move it to the text layer. Change Geometric Softness 1 to 0. Gray Level Softness 1 to 0 percent. Gray Level Softness 2 to 0 percent. And Choke 1 to minus 127. We are going to change the color of the shadow from white to black. Go to effect and presets, and search for fill and move it to the text layer. Change the color to black. And reduce the opacity to 41%. Go to Effect and Presets, and search for CC Composite, and move it to the text layer. Uncheck RGB only. Also search for Linear Wipe and move it to the text layer. I'm changing my resolution to full. Change transition completion to 6%. Wipe angle to 39 degree. And feather to 106. We are going to animate the text. Open Animate and add Opacity. Open Range Selector and change the opacity to 0%. Go to 0 seconds and add Keyframe to Start and go to 2 seconds. Change Start to 100%. 
select all keyframe and easy ease, you can press F9 on your keyboard. Then go to graph editor. If your curve is not like this, right click and change it to edit speed graph. Select the keyframe and change the curve to something like this. Then go back to time align. We are going to animate the shadow. Go to CC Radial Fast Blur and add keyframe to the center at once seconds. Press U to open all keyframe. Move the timeline to 0 seconds then move the anchor point to the right top of the composition. Press spacebar to preview. Also you can add this shadow to shapes as well. Go to shapes and click ellipse tool. Then hold shift and drag your shape. Move the shape to the center of the composition. Click the text layer and switch to effect control. Select all the effect you can press Ctrl plus A, and copy the effect you press Ctrl plus C. Click the shape layer and paste the effect. You can adjust the layer. Let's see the preview. Move your timeline to 2 seconds and trim the edge. You can press Alt plus right bracket. Let's see the preview. Press N to reduce the timeline. Thank you for watching this tutorial. If you like this tutorial, please make sure you like, and share this video and also subscribe to my channel for more tutorial. Thank you.